Hi, folks. Larry Wingett here. You know, we hear all these people talking. If you've listened to my speeches, you've heard me trash this whole idea before. People talk about the secrets of success. I put out a little card a few years ago, one of these little postcards. And listen, if you want some of my postcards and my free stuff, whoop, there we go. Uh, go to my website. Look under free stuff. That'd be a good place to look. And if you want to pass these out, a lot of people do. i got dozens of these things, uh, different ones that say different things. Uh, you can order them by the hundred there. But what I said on this card was there are no secrets to success. Solve a problem. You know, it really does come down to that. You have to be a problem solver. You solve a problem to get your job, whether it be you're working for yourself, solopreneur, entrepreneur, whatever, or whether you work for a big company, whether you're a janitor, whether you're CEO, you solve somebody's problem. If you didn't solve a problem, they wouldn't have hired you. Uh, so that's what it comes down to. You have to solve a problem. And the bigger the problem you solve, the more money you get paid. I mean, it's not that complicated to say, do you want fries with that? That's why it pays what it does. It is complicated to solve big, big problems. And so that has more value in the marketplace. It's the way the world works. The way the world ought to work. We're paid for the value. Which is number two, solve a problem, add some value. We're paid for our value. Number three, be worth more than you cost. Now, listen, you think, well, I get paid uh, $25 an hour. I'm just picking a number. doesn't matter what I say here. It could have been $1,000 an hour. It could have been $10,000 an hour. It could have been $8 an hour. But the point is, <clears throat> that's what you're paid. Now, you've got to understand that if you work for an employer, there's a whole lot more goes into that than just eight bucks. I mean, it, it, look up the percentages of change all the time, but it's at least half again as much as what you cost them. Uh, so now you're paid one and a half times what you're actually getting, and maybe more in some cases. Okay, you have to bring to the value to compensate. The other side of that is if you cost 25 and it's half again as much, so let's say you're up to 40 bucks an hour, if you don't bring $40 worth of revenue into them, you are considered an expense. You cannot be an expense to anyone. Uh, then you're not worth it. So you have to bring in more revenue than you cost the people you're working for. And again, it's solopreneur, entrepreneur. People say, well, you don't understand when I'm a solopreneur. Holy crap, don't be so narrow-minded like some people can get... I, if there's anything in the world that pisses me off, it's that you don't understand my situation. You are just exactly like everybody else. That's how it is. We're all just alike. We're all, I'm providing service. If I wasn't providing you any service, you'd click off and never pay your damn $7 a month again. But hopefully you're getting $7 worth of value out of it. That's why you pay your $7 a month in order to get these videos. Mine, Chris, us, together. But if I didn't provide that value... You wouldn't do it. We have to understand we're all just alike. We are paid according to the value we bring to the marketplace. So you have to solve a problem, bring value. You have to be worth more than it costs to solve that problem. And then the last one, outwork everyone. Folks, I would buy this, this little card right here, and I'd put it in the hands of everybody who worked for me if I had a big company. By the way, you have to give credit, copyrighted. Outwork everyone. There's just something that can be said for just working hard. Trouble is, people just work hard enough to get by. You know, Les Brown used to say, work hard enough so they won't fire me, and they pay me just enough so I won't quit. Sadly, that's the situation of most people right now. But if you solve a problem, add value, are worth more than you cost, and you outwork everybody, there you go. That's what it takes these days. It's what it's always taken. We got lazy somewhere along the way. Go do it.